What's up guys? Welcome to Life Roll Poker. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on one of my favorite poker software tools that is a Hold'em Indicator. As you can see on the left hand, that is the actual indicator tool. Uh, what it does is it records hands, it gives you hand strength, it gives you your expected value against other possible hands, it gives you pot odds, it gives you win odds. This thing is a huge tool in your success of online poker. The reason why I chose to do Hold'em Indicator first is because it is the first tool that I had. And believe me when I tell you, I've made thousands of dollars using this tool. It just gives you a lot of information, especially if you're pretty new to the game, of what you can expect your specific hand to do against other hands. Uh, another, another nice thing I like about this tool is if you look, it comes with a HUD as well. A uh, heads-up display gives you all the information about the players. It gives you all the information about the hand, type of hands they like to play, uh, how aggressive they are pre-flop, how aggressive they are on the turn, how aggressive they are with three betting. It gives you all the heads-up display information that you need. Uh, the, this specific tool, I will tell you, is a little bit pricey. When I tell you pricey, it's $99. But that $99, you have it for life. You can move it to different laptops you can move it to different computers uh, if your computer crashes which mine actually did not too long ago i just sent them out an email told them my new information they gave me a new login right so you pay 99 dollars, and then it's yours for life and you will earn a lot of money on this and it's a great great tool to teach you how to start playing specific hands and different types of hands uh, it tells you what kind of hand strength you have. It tells you your outs, which is huge if you're playing flushes and straights. Uh, it gives you your win odds, as I mentioned. So your win odds against these type of hands, right? So you'll probably be facing, you know, most likely, two pair because there's already a pair on the board. So somebody over 51% has another pair, has a seven, has a five, has a pair of nines, wherever it might be. Um, but it's just a really nice tool. I'd like to get a hand to show you all the information. I might even just play the next hand just to show you, no matter what the cards are. Shall we? I think that's a good idea. Let's do it. So I will be in the big blind down here. And I got the, the lovely 4-7 offsuit. Um, as you can see, 22%, 23 So I'm getting 1-4 to four pot odds right now because he did not raise it up pretty good. So we're going to go ahead and call it because I'm getting decent pot odds, right? So there it is. I got nothing, right? Nothing, not even a, a decent straight draw. So I'm going to check back. So I'm down to 17% to win this. So the odds are I'm not going to win this hand based on my hand strength. So what I'd have to do if I want to win this hand, try to raise it up from the 14 cents that he did now, try to get him to fold. Maybe get him to fold uh, a king queen, a king jack, uh, make him think I might have that flush draw. So let's go ahead and raise it up because I'm not going to win with the 4 7 rags. So. Plan in this hand is if he re raises, just fold. If he calls, I'll probably just shut down as well because he probably does have something. Oh, there we go. As you can see, I was not going to win that with just the cards. That told me that. So I need to be aggressive there and, and try to take down what he already put in the pot. Ace 10, my expected value is pretty good here. Uh, not in the best position, of course, being in the small line, but I think it's at least worth a call here. So we'll go ahead and call it. Could have raised. Definitely, definitely can make an argument for re-raising there. Um, so we got my ace. I'm going to go ahead and check. Look, 77%. I'm most likely up against another pair. If I'm up against another pair, I'm probably ahead of that pair. So again, he might have just seen me re-raise this guy. So I'm going to go ahead and do that again. See if he make, thinks I'm playing around. So go ahead and raise it up to the 60 cents. And uh, go from there. See what happens. He definitely could have a better ace. right? But he could have a pair of... Uh, he could have a pair of nines. Hope he didn't have the deuce. All right, but I'm going to go ahead and start taking the lead on this hand. Um, you know what? No, I'm going to let him barrel off to me. So if he has a, a, a hand like ace-8, ace-7, I'm going to let him, let him keep betting into me and see what happens. Um, but as you can see, I have my odds here. Uh, 2 gives me a, a flush. Uh, 10 gives me 2 pair. So he raised, he raised a decent amount. We'll go ahead and call it down. Seven. I bet. So I am going to lose this hand. I lose this hand one out of four times. But I win this hand three out of four times. With a check back, I win. I mean, I almost guaranteed it. He had a king. He had two kings. Not Definitely not a bad hand. I think he played his hand all right. I think we played our hand all right. Uh, a little passive. Could have been a little more aggressive there. Uh, but as, if you guys are watching the odds, and it, I just had the way better odds of winning that hand. 
Really like this tool. Really, really recommend this tool. I'm going to go ahead and uh, put the links down into the page. Go ahead and click on that. Uh, make sure you check out my white, my webpage, liferollpoker.com. Uh, with there, you will see coaching. You will see all the good stuff on there. You'll see poker strategy. Uh, you will see pre-flop hand ranges. You'll see all the good stuff. Liferollpoker.com. I'll go ahead and link it in the, in the bottom. Uh, give me some feedback. This is my first video, so it's a little choppy, but I'm okay with that. I'm only going to get better. Um, so go ahead and check out the page. Check out the Hold'em Indicator. Go ahead and purchase that Hold'em Indicator. You will.